We are watching breaking news right now. A crash involving a bright line train has left a pedestrian dead this morning in Delray Beach. Unfortunately, it does come on the same day the high speed rail line is debuting its new route from Miami to Orlando. We have team coverage, including how this crash is impacting the busy morning commute, as well as details on the new route to Orlando. First, let's begin with Local 10's Leanne Waterhall live in Delray Beach with more on what happened here. Leanne. So what we heard from Delray Beach police was that they were called out here at around 6.15 this morning as a result of an impact between a bright line train and a person on the tracks. Let's take you to some video from earlier this morning. This all happening in Delray Beach at Southeast 2nd Avenue and Southeast 4th Street. This is an area of train tracks that are flanked by warehouses on one side and some homes on the other and then bordered by some chain link fence. Again, we do know that this happened just around 615 this morning. One person was hit by the train and pronounced dead. We did see crews here, investigators uh, looking at that body. They took it from the scene into the medical examiner's vehicle just a short time ago. We also understand that the bright line train that made the impact did leave the scene just a few minutes ago. We know that this was a southbound train. There were a couple of neighboring streets that were closed off, but it did not seem to impact any traffic uh, at large. This is not a major intersection or a major thoroughfare by any means. So this scene has cleared, but boy, what a blemish on the debut day of the Miami to Orlando route for Brightline. Uh, one person sadly is dead. We understand that according to the preliminary investigation, this seems to be an instance where the person wanted to take their own life. For now, reporting in Delray Beach, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.